stay. All right, what's going on, everyone? I said stay. What up, Charlie? Uh, today, gotta clean off the trailer. Yeah, I know. Uh, got a ton of dog food stocked up on it when uh, Pet Value was going out of business. Bunch of dog food, cat food. I stock up on things that way. It's cheaper in the long run for me. Man, I got all these weights in the way. Picked up these weights uh, from a scrap call. Trying to sell them, but no luck right now. A lot of people saying $2 a pound. People keep trying to... Uh, well, I, I'm only selling them for like a uh, dollar fifty a pound. Trying to, but no luck so far. Oh, so we just picked up this freezer yesterday. I have a freezer in the yard that. No, it's not the same one. That sucks. But I do need the hinges off of here to fix my freezer in the yard and sell that. But this is the stuff I uh, went to a clean out yesterday with Dave. Got some stuff. Nothing too fantastic. Oh yeah, always gotta pick them up. All these always fall off the trailer and stuff. But... As I was saying, nothing too fantastic. Got a truckload of stuff also, and uh, I don't know. We'll show you what we what we found. I'm extra tired. My back hurts, but work never ends. Still never found a tire. And don't got the money to go buy a brand new one right now. Alright. Alright, we'll get you guys back once I get this beast off. Alright, so here's some of the stuff I grabbed. I did not want that damn cabinet. But Dave kind of insisted on it. Uh... Hopefully I could drop it off to his house and be away with it. But got a cool uh, uh, log splitter. I got a bunch of logs. Guy said it worked. I'm hoping it works. That way I could split some wood and everything. And also one like this that is like uh, used and I want to say when it's almost on its like last life use it to split your motors put your motor right here pushes it cuts it in half watching videos on that so always wanted to get one try it out guy said this was sitting outside for years and years and years so not sure if it still works it works when he last had it but got like this cool thing old sifter figure it's worth like 75 bucks I think that was one of the one of the nicer things I grabbed. I didn't grab too much nice things. Uh, well, Dave knows more about the antiques and all that, so he kind of grabs all that stuff. I kind of just grab what I can. Uh, I'll show you guys. No, I don't. Uh, I don't got my keys on me, so I can't show you that. I got something in the truck that I was very happy about. I want to say this is like an old rug beater. I mean, that's at least one thing I learned from Dave. So, grab that. I grab kind of stupid stuff. I like these glasses. Eh, they're cool, but... They're not going to bring huge money. Got some Coke bottles in there. 
might actually keep them for my truck but don't even think i need them like that's heavy as ever but there's not much money in it and i grab stuff like this just to like uh figure i could put this in the ground and it gives me either a seat or something to beat on warranted I've seen this before and I know what it's used for but my mind does not work sometimes this goes at the bottom of the well thought it was pretty cool looking but I don't know I grabbed different things like the mason jars and everything people always buy them figured the lamp it has a cool like neon color like greenish I don't know Ugh. old bottles and everything but my stuff definitely moves around in the trailer like everything was all stacked neat here by the time we get home wait where's my oh yeah our hand carts there by the time I get home everything's all moved around everything's all spread out and since I used to do construction in the past grab the leaf spring uh no uh what, what the hell are they called they're not leaf springs that's uh for the trailer uh God. stringers for stairs three sets oh what do we got yeah see got some old bottles and everything but nothing to a value just old clock oh, see picture already broke but Stuff always moves a lot more on a trailer than it does like a truck. So, and the old, old, old typewriter was pretty cool. Had to grab that, but like I said, nothing much to a value. Start getting some of this stuff off and uh, we'll show you as we come along as I'm kicking more nails off the trailer. dog definitely wants me he's like trying to get out all right let's get the trailer unloaded and then we'll show you guys what we got on the truck but like i said garage is starting to become empty yeah more more cat food told you i stocked up <sighs> garage is starting to become empty because haven't been buying lockers that lately freaking just I don't know doing what I can but all right let's get this unloaded all right trailers all cleaned off swept ready for the next job just got this damn thing on here now oh yay all right let's Park the trailer and then uh gonna run the magnet around here because a bunch of nails been dropping off and everything. Uh where'd it go? Oh yeah, I got my rolling magnet. That helped pick up all the nails off the trailer. But the little stuff that fell off I wanna pick up also. That was all like the junk that was left over from the job. Alright, let's get this all packed up, swept and we'll show you guys what we got on the truck next all right let's explore see what kind of stuff we picked up Come on old fan figure try to clean it up a little bit sell it for like three to five bucks if not scrap it but sometimes uh Haitian people, they always buy it. And again, people, like I said before, if you get offended by some of the stuff I say, like if I call somebody a Haitian, don't get offended by it. I just speak my mind. 
old ice cream maker. I thought that was pretty cool. Like, I don't know. Junk to some people, but figure if I could try to sell it, I'll sell it. Oh, I know I'm getting people dizzy. Found a laptop. Uh, when it looks like this good, usually I could sell them pretty easy, 25 bucks. I know it's an older model, but still pretty nice. I mean, you can get a lot more if you sell them online, but I don't even power it up or anything. I just put it on the table. One guy comes, he always buys all of them from me. 25 bucks a piece. Even uh, sold an old, old one that was like a box. Like, see, I got a few of them I found. Found an old, old one that was like literally a box. Still, he paid me 25 bucks. He don't complain nothing. And like I told him, I find them in cleanouts, lockers, everything like that. Don't know if they work. He probably uh, cleans them up, resells them. Uh, no idea what this was. Kind of just grabbed it. It's like an old heavy duty uh, water can. But other than that, uh, well, Dave took most of these, but so I ended up getting my stuff for free because me and Dave strike the deal. He takes all these and I don't know anything, but they were these watch movements. If we looked them up about $45 a piece on eBay I mean I know Dave's on make a couple thousand off of them because there was like 50 boxes of these but he missed two of them I told him I was taking the last two that were up in the attic so I don't know maybe I'll try to sell mine but like I said all my stuff literally I didn't have to pay for just because of that a ah, nice little cooler. I mean, a little rubber made. Easy five bucks, and then the cage itself. All right, let me move some of this stuff, and we'll get you guys back. But oh, this box was full of uh, mason jars. So got a bunch of mason jars. Got this heavy pole. It's good for uh, pounding stuff. Like if I don't have a sledgehammer nearby, this thing is heavy itself. And we'll beat anything. Alright, we'll get you guys right back. Alright. And now we grab the small heater. I mean, it's another $5 item. That's kind of what I grabbed. A lot of $5 items. Not really nothing fancy, too expensive and everything. Because that's what I make my money on. Five dollar items, they sell quick. Got this cool bottle. I like it a lot. Like, I don't know why. Stuff like this. I don't know. It just sticks out to me. But, oh, uh, grab the bullets. Because, pandemic time. Eh. I know you can't sell bullets, but there's always a market for everything believe me and just other kind of want to say junk but that's kind of what it is is junk knickknacks cool hammer but a little busted has a name on it don't know but it was cool I mean that's like a three dollar item four dollar item the old level it works. So yeah, I grabbed stupid stuff. Not nothing too expensive. Uh, what my buddy Dave calls me is uh, the vacuum. When I show up, 
I take up everything. <laughs> like, no matter what it is, it may be junk, it may be little old trash can, but I take everything. <laughs> like the old souls. Eh, figure they might sell. Like, I even grabbed this thing, but wood I notice is all eaten out. But it's an old farm tool. Yeah, it's like way done. <sighs> Alright, gotta move this and then, like I said, another fan, another two fans. Got the deer horns. I mean, it's kind of dumb, you can't sell them like this, but if I put them on, like, if I put them on this piece of wood, boom, it's mounted, you can sell it, which is totally, totally stupid. Like, they got stupid laws on that, but, and then there's stupid ways to get around it. You could be like, oh, here, I'll give you this, but you're giving me a donation for something else. beat up fans there was more but that's all we grabbed uh, this is just old dolls and everything said more junk it's not much but at the Keurigger some stupid lights stupid Halloween thing another old bottle cow head not a real cow head and these old McDonald's cups figure they were kind of sellable they have no date on them oh yes they do 1977 We'll actually have to look that up. We got a few of them in here. And just it's basically junk. Like dollar stuff, five dollar stuff. The oil lamp that uh, isn't real, it's uh, plastic. We grabbed a big... Uh, was a pontoon thing to go on somebody's car but got that got the bike another fan some scrap and we got some stuff in the back that we have to unload let me get some of this off and we'll get you guys back also grab the hook because when you're in the trailer and you don't want to go all the way in you hook one of the totes underneath you can pull them. I was going to buy one because it's easy to get the totes off the trailer, on the trailer. But now I don't need to. Uh, do, 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 do. Plus, the old bike is probably worth like 40 bucks. Alright. Yeah, I grabbed like some old dresses. I don't know. Trying different things but old like nice wedding dress kind of vintage grab the fire ring want to keep that for the house and then basically up here it's just scrap aluminum except for this 
old wire basket but I didn't grab nothing too special oh, well now that I got the truck moved I'll show you my favorite thing I got out of the whole deal basically why I didn't complain or nothing Got like cows on it. I thought that was pretty cool. Like my neighbor likes cows, but yeah, he's kind of mad at me right now for some stupid reason. But I thought this was very awesome. They're all the same thing, but it's pretty neat. And I thought that would make a Cool gift to my neighbor, try to make up for whatever he's mad at me about, but whatever. Like, that's the thing I liked the most. I know it's not much, but it's things like that that make me happy. And then, uh, our cooler, oh, uh, what else? Cooler full of just something for the toilet old army bag some dolls that are missing heads and bodies and all that basically more junk so like you guys saw no no hundred dollar items or anything I did have that one nice pot with a lid but ended up giving that to Dave for 40 bucks, but we're taking that out of the scrap money. Uh, we did, what was it, 173 for the scrap, which wasn't bad. I kept stupid stuff like this. Keep seeing like all the war movies and everything. Figure somebody may buy it. Grabbed uh, two other posters in here. Don't know where they went. Uh, right there. Yeah, and I know where he got back. Like an old Beatles poster. Try to straighten that out. And then got old Marilyn Monroe one. But yeah, told you I grabbed stupid stuff. not stupid if it makes you happy how about that figure boogie board summer's coming up maybe I want to go to the beach and use it when I was a kid I used to do I liked riding the waves into shore like any kid would but other than that, we just got some more mason jars in there, some glasses, and that's it. And some old lamps, going to try to sell, but not too sure. And that was literally it. I mean, we didn't grab that much, but like I said, the log splitter, uh, I tried that, it worked. So that was good. The lamp stupid stuff like that all right we'll see everybody later thank you all for watching and i know this video dragged on i talk a lot but that's just me <laughs> all right we'll see everybody later bye all right well moment of truth got all this wood haven't been able to split it but we'll see if this log splitter actually does its job I actually never used a log square before, so. Very loud. Very, very loud. And a 
it kind of works. kind of too wet still so it's just gonna keep kind of splintering but I don't know it kind of works uh, I gotta hold the button and do that stupid but for free log splitter you can't complain <sighs> now what all right well thank you everyone for watching we still gotta let the wood dry out a little bit longer and we'll see everybody later all right bye